In PowerMill, three new options are available when creating curves. The user can now create an ellipse, a spiral, or a helix curve. It can do this by opening up the curve editor for a active pattern or a boundary. In the curve editor toolbar, under the create icon, you now see the three new options. If I click to create an ellipse, I can either snap it to a point using the intelligent cursor or I can input a starting coordinate. Once I have my curve placed, the options form will open up. For an ellipse, I can define either the major axis length the minor axis length and the points in each quadrant of the curve. I can also interactively use the grab handles to control some of these options. Once I have my curve created I just hit OK. It is worth pointing out though that once you have created it it is not editable afterwards. If I do the same for Spiral, I'm just going to choose to create Spiral, select a point in my window, and then we see the options available to build that Spiral. We have a starting radius, an end radius, uh, a number of turns between these two radii, and then points in each turn. We can also reverse the direction if we want, so that would change the direction of the Spiral like so. And finally, the third new addition is to create a helix. So if I just click create helix, open up my options form, I'm just going to tilt the view a little so you can see exactly what we are creating. For helix, we can define the height, the pitch, the amount of turns, the points in each turn, the top, and the bottom radius and then we also have a number of options available as checkboxes. What we can also do is lock one of these three parameters where if we enter a value of the others the locked one will remain the same and we can only lock one at a time. So again once I create my curve and hit OK, it is now uneditable within PowerMill. If you need to make changes, you would have to create a new curve. These three new additions to PowerMill are designed to make it easier for users to migrate between PowerShape and PowerMill. These options are already available in PowerShape so it just improves the usability of Paramil as a whole.